You already know who it is. Back at another video for you guys today. So, we're going to check out American Horror Story Double Feature Part 1. Red Tide. How many parts is it going? Anyway, y'all, y'all already know Season 10. I'll be reviewing it next week. So, stay tuned for that. Let's check out this trailer, shall we? In about a three, two. I can't believe we're doing this. I never thought I'd get you out of the city. I think this is going to be the perfect Ooh, place pregnant. to work without. Look at Misty. I've been coming out here to write for a few years now. This place inspires us. I could really use some of the inspiration you guys have. You look dead out there. I'm facing some serious writer's block. That won't last long. Trust me. <laughs> Something weird is going on here, and I want to know what it is. Oh, look at my coat. There's nothing more addictive than success. You tasted it now. Oh, You're never going to be able to live without it. <laughs> oh, they're all You're not safe here. Beautiful things. I'm trying to keep this family together under very yeah. difficult circumstances. Yeah. I think I know why they call it double feature because, you know, if you remember from the poster. Like at the top, it was an alien head, and then like it was the mouth of like an evil ass mermaid or something. So hence the whole thing double featured, and then part one. So I wonder like is part one gonna be mostly like with the mermaids and shit, like because it looked like that's where they gonna be at, you know? And then probably part two, like probably will go into the whole alien thing. I could be wrong, but I, you know, that's what I'm kind of getting so far. But y'all, this looks crazy. I think it was worth the wait because it's been like, what, a whole year and a half? Since, oh! As I was saying, it's been a whole year and a half since American Horror Story came on. So, yeah. Like, and then they even made the little short, like, American Horror Stories. I haven't watched that yet, but I've been definitely waiting for the real American Horror Story to come back on. So. I'm excited to see what it's about. Like, and then the whole double feature thing, because like I said, we get the aliens and you got the evil demonic looking mermaids. So I'm interested. I can't wait to review this show for you guys. I'm excited, that's it. With that being said, if you guys enjoyed this video, please hit the like button. Matter of fact, also, I'm curious to see what Macaulay Culkin is gonna do on this show. Cause I remember, I, I remember them uh mentioning that he's gonna be on the show so i want to see what that's gonna be about but yeah if you guys enjoyed this video please hit the like button comment below your thoughts on season 10 of american horror story you guys excited and overall out of all nine seasons because we haven't gotten to season 10 yet uh what's your favorite season out of all of them? all of them. for me i like coven what else which, which which one else did i like i like hotel too very spooky creepy hotel vibes and whatnot. Um, I did like Apocalypse because the witches came back, you know what I'm saying? Like Cordelia, Queen, you understand what I'm saying? Um, I did like 1984, I just, I appreciated the whole like Camp Crystal Lake, Friday the 13th, 80s vibe along with it. So, you know, not saying that I didn't like like any of the other seasons, but you know how you have your favorites, like, you have a favorite artist, so like they come up with an album, you have your favorite songs or whatever, so go figure. But yeah, so you guys let me know some of your favorite seasons of American Horror Story. Are you looking forward to season 10? Do you like the whole double feature effect? Aliens, evil mermaids, this is something different. But then again, too, this is Ryan Murphy. You know he crazy with, with, the, with the creativity, it's insane. So shout out to him and all the people involved in American Horror Story. Shout out to Sarah Paulson. Good, gonna be good to see her back on screen regarding this show, of course. 
And yeah, if there's anything else I can react to for you guys, let me know in the comment section as well. Hit that subscribe button, follow me on my Instagram, hit the notification bell so you guys know a video has been loaded. And y'all listen, just be patient with me. I know I've been gone again for a little minute, but like I said, it's just been real busy over here life, you know. So, oh uh, yeah, just give me some time and uh, I'll definitely be back up and running like a brand new car, which is something I'm trying to get. So y'all please, anybody out there, um, just wish me luck finding a car, trying to do that this weekend. And uh, yeah, quick story time. I didn't tell you guys this already. I had a Jeep, right? Nice Jeep, Jeep Patriot, right? Uh, one time it was in a hit and run situation. I didn't do it. Somebody hit my ass on the side in the bike, right? Then several months later, slowly but surely, it was something wrong with my transmission. When I started to drive it, it started like jaking, whatever, you know what I'm saying? And before you know it, the transmission went out. Yes, it did, yes, yes, it did. So I, you know, could have gotten it fixed, but I just figured like, why not get another car? Something like more up to date, because that one is 2013, I believe. So, you know, but we'll, we're gonna get something. Everything is slowly, but surely, you know, getting according to plan so uh just be patient with me like i said there'll be newer videos to come so just stay tuned next week american horror story and uh especially the chucky show i don't know if i'm gonna react to it or like review it i'm still thinking about it i have time but yep i'll see you guys in the next video i appreciate it always i appreciate the subscribers the comments all of that i appreciate you guys very much for still showing me love and i'll see you on the next video have a great safe weekend stay cool if you're hot Stay warm if you're cold somewhere in Alaska or something like that. Unless climate change and it's like 100 degrees. Now, I'm going to tell y'all this. I know climate change is a real thing. I wish I knew about it like sooner, like when I was younger. If I ever go outside <laughs> on, around Christmas time and it's like 70 degrees, <laughs> you know something is awry, okay? You might want to go back in the house and pray. Okay, you go outside on December 25th, like if you live somewhere where it's cold, but was where it should be cold, and you go outside and it's like 70 to 100 something degrees. Yep, yeah, it's time to go in the house and pray and hide because something is a rock. Because you're gonna fuck around, look up in the sky, and it's gonna be red, so you know something is <laughs> where the four horsemen. See you guys in the next video, you guys. I love you guys. Appreciate you. See you on the next one. Stay Lorraine. And I'm out.